Hey, I'm Zach here, and today we are back for another FX Rated Career Mode video. And we're here for the Canadian Grand Prix. You may be wondering, why is Canada for episode, apparently, number three? I tried to record China, didn't work, so this is apparently number three. Number three. We won the race, we got a one and two, technically. But there's one thing I wanted to show you. This game now has the 2022 cars, which is just crazy. I mean, look, look at this. I mean, I'm, I'm exactly 15,000 away. I might try and do a, uh, a video soon. Hopefully, if I get, there. if I eventually get there, I'll have to do a lot of uh, grinding graphics racer. But hey, we've got that original sort of car there. You got the like a uh, Ferrari, the Alpine without the whole BWT thing. Aston Martin, Williams without anything else. But yeah, very, very, very cool. Uh, that's ten thousand, and then that's that's like the twenty twenty one spec sort of car. This is the like twenty thirty sort of car. Probably not even that, 2050 probably or something. Indie car, slash classic F1, Raw and GP as well, very, very cool. And then you've also got 2022. But we are, we're in the bog standard, sort of like the, like the 2010, 2013 20, era sort of car. And we're not doing fast race, doing World Championship. We're going to do Canada at night. I'm very good at Canada. Very, very good. I feel very comfortable around this track. So now we're going to have to try convert this into a win. We currently lead the World Championship. Go into this race. Ready hitting. Now the fourth light on. Fifth light on. Lights out and away we go. Can we get a good start? We were starting going 11th on the grid there. We get a great start. Now can we have a go into turn one? Oh my God, lock on. And we've collided with our teammate. We've collided with our teammate. We come back onto the circuit. We almost collide again really. But disastrous start for us. We each could um, uh, stay, we'd stay with each other to with the World Championship, I've got, I've got no groove whatsoever. And we've collided again. There'll be massive friction in the team debrief tonight. Or, well, in the morning, I'm guessing. But it's horrendous opportunity. Well, that was a great opportunity for Lewis Hamilton. Remember in Malaysia last episode, he won. So I don't know where he is in Madrid. Didn't see him in the, in the bottom t um, in the bottom five. So I'm assuming he's gaining points on us. So it, we only need the championship by a few points. But it's not good at all. We look back. We, we, we look, well, we're looking back. We need to look ahead now. And try and... Because now, now we're going to have to switch our strategy. I was thinking maybe doing a one-stop. Or maybe doing a one-stopper. But now we're going to have to quickly divert our strategy to a... Um, probably a two or even a three-stop here in Canada. So now we fly off almost to the rear end. I feel very comfortable. The AI are not quicker. and not quick around it at all. I feel like I can capitalise. Look at look at Button. Look how much time he's in there. Problem is, whoa! You see, that's what I was about to explain to. If they do, if they do break. We're going to be in big trouble with the crash. So we've got we got cautious, but we've also got to send it. Cut the corner a little bit there. Almost cut over Charles Leclerc. Very very close indeed. He almost died. Very scary. But yeah, happened to P. I don't know what position we're in. Let me just move the recording. There we go. We got a bad exit. Charles Leclerc gaining on us here. The real life Roy man gaining us. Do this great race. It goes Charles Leclerc going very wide there. Is Sean. Now can we hopefully move on? P8. Two positions away from the points. For the end of the series, the top six get points. Like the classic, like the classic sort of format. But yeah, we are gaining on. We've got, we've got to try and gain them or gain them, gain on them. The video should be quite short because the um oh yeah there, there's actually there, I was about to say there's Lewis Hamilton we could gain massive massive points on here on Lewis if we go around the outside down switch to the inside line so lovely move lovely switch back move and we got me yeah we got him I think maybe I think he may be covering off Hamilton oh Hamilton collides with us Lewis Hamilton has just hit us we're gonna give him that a position we're gonna be a fair sportsman as Lewis is. Okay, I don't, I don't, I don't need angry Max fans in the comments, please. But here comes Charles Leclerc, again, defending. I'm in a great battle here with Jensen Button as well, who's lurking behind Charles in the sort of Williams Alfa Romeo livery thing. This has got to be a good act for us. Take turn one exceptionally well. Now flying through turn two and three. Gaining on, Lewis, we're gaining on Hamilton, gaining on him. Now, I'm thinking we're gonna. Um, we're not aiming for the win. We go past Lewis here. Almost. Oh, make contact again, though! Again! 
Another race, another car act out acting as a mobile chicane there. And Hamilton, oh, I was looking behind. We cut the, the corner a bit there. But I'm thinking, well, P6, P7, I think we are in. So no one's getting points. Except, I think, um, obviously, obviously no one, no one that number is getting points. Verstappen pits. Aim for, aim to, oh, I'm going to aim to beat Verstappen this race. Maybe something, maybe something, that's not seem like a big ass, but I think we can do it. Then it is Lewis Hamilton. It is Hamilton coming to the pits. Is it Hamilton? Yes, it is. But I think, I think there has been, there's been, there's been, there's been contact in the pit lane, I think, actually. Between Verstappen and Russell, I believe. I saw it on the mini-map there. So, we're currently out in P4. So, very, very good. Doing good more recovery drives. So, now we're going to uh, maybe pit early. Try and get a jump on a car ahead of us. It's got to be a good in-lap, though. We're a bit too wide there. On the exit, we don't, we don't take too much curb. But now you can see we're flying through these corners. Got a bit of time, a bit, bit of time here, a bit of time there on this lap. But I'm thinking actually, oh, I, can, I can never get, I can never get the hairpin right. I'm thinking we're going to do one more lap, try and catch up to whoever that is, or actually they're, they're going to come in. So now that's two people in, three people in, three people in. We lead the Grand Prix. I think we're going to stay out. We're going to keep, um, we're going to keep pushing. And keep staying out. Because we last time we did that in Malaysia, and that paid off massively for us. We tried landing cut, it worked. Now we're going to try a massive overcut. I think there has been a kind of look, look at the gap we've got. To a cars behind. I don't know. I, I don't know whether to ex try and extend the stint and then risk a um, a slow sort of. Black, black, well, I'm calling it a slow puncher because if you know what happens, if you're an FX racer, that is actually what happens. So I'm thinking maybe I don't know whether to extend. Yeah, a bit of a dilemma. I don't know how to extend, but you know, I think we are going to come in eventually in this lap. You know, we're gaining time on the cars behind. But I think now is the ideal time to do it. Yeah, we, we, want, we, we can still win this race. We're going to go for one more absolutely ding-dong hot lap around Canada. We're going to have to push like um, Hamilton in Brazil, really. Channel our inner Lewis Hamilton spirit. And just absolutely send it, I suppose. You know, we've got nothing to lose here. We've got the championship lead. We can extend it even more. We've got a decent gap already in the championship. We've got in, we've sort of actually got the Verstappen scenario, really. Bit in reverse because of the third episode and the crash. But yeah, this has been a great lap so far. It's been a sensation lap. Look at the... We, we, we're close to lapping people. But now here's the crucial part of the lap, the chicane. We don't... We mess, we mess up on the chicane a bit. Yeah, we are going to box this lap. You see there, low grip. Perfectly timed. We re-extended it to the absolute maximum. This has got to be a good start. I'm thinking maybe the mediums, just to play it safe. That's a good pit stop from our crew. Now, where we come out? I'm thinking P3 we're going to come out. Here we go. We're going down the pit lane now. Crucial thing is, where is everyone else? So we're going to come out now. Are we going to come out in first? No, we're not. George Russell leads the Canadian Grand Prix. Right, we can now chase after Russell. The overcut has worked a treat for us. We, 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 we let all the chaos come out in the pits. We didn't go in when, 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 we, when we were planning to. And now we've got an opportunity to win this race. You've got much fresh size than Russell. Russell might have to pit, really. We're going to go down inside of Russell. We had a sensational out last time with him and his teammate Lewis Hamilton, who we crashed with already. And now, oh, Russell! Oh, we get oh, we almost crash into him. It's almost a um, carbon copy of the Norris move, but it, um, but it was with the crash. I think it was no, was it Norris or was I don't remember. But this is going down to the wire here in Canada, just like Malaysia. We got two laps to try and get past Russell. I think we, we, we should have gone for the super soft. Because I don't know why. But yeah, playing it safe is the key thing. We don't have a, blow, a blowout now. It'll be absolutely horrendous. Now, take the FX Reeve off turn one. Here we go. Into turn two and three. These are massive, massive crucial corners. And Russell. Oh, we have to back out of there. We almost crash again. But now we're going to go around the outside of Russell. Oh, he forced us off the trap there. Russell forces us off. Can we stay ahead of Russell? This is going to be crucial. Because Russell, if he wins this, he'll be right on us. The championship! I have to slam on the brakes again! Now we're going to take an outside. We're going to just lift off a bit here. Try and get a better exit. 
And I'm now, we have a, we have a, we've got a lag. We had a massive screen freeze. We're turning into our, our, our other videos here, apparently. And Russell Pitts, Russell's pit from the lead. What's he doing? He got one lap, why wouldn't you risk it? But we lead. Incredible. We, um, it turns out, well, I knew, I knew Russell had high tie wear, but I thought he was going to stay out. But we lead by a huge, look at the gap. We lead by an absolutely, the pair is a pit well from third. So is Hamilton from fourth. We, we've played with strategy and perfection. Our championship rivals could not hang on. They could not do the uh, business with their tyres. We, on the other hand, have dominated this race. Because we are moments away. We are two corners away. The infamous War of the Champions awaits us. And the podium is where we will now celebrate. Well, if, wait, if it was a cutscene. Sadly, it's not. But here we go then. Round the last couple of the corners. We couldn't do it last season because everything didn't go well. But we just jolly do it. We win the Canadian Grand Prix. Great, great race. And we need to extend our championship lead. Exactly what we needed. After Malaysia, after missing out, we've got a massive lead in the championship. George Russell second. Hamilton moves down to seventh. Tied on points. With Charles Leclerc. No, actually no, hang on. My eyes, no. Hamilton's seventh. Norris is on point, tied on points with Leclerc. Look how close though. 5th, 6th, 7th, and 8th, and even, yeah, even, even, um, even ninth sort of. But yeah, everyone, that will end today's video. If you did enjoy the video, please like and subscribe to the channel. Next race will be, not be in Spain, because we're going to skip that one. It will be in Monaco, so very, we, we all know what's going to happen there. Chaos. So yeah, if you did enjoy the video, please like and subscribe to the channel. I'm trying to get the 200, sorry, 350 subscribers, and 500 by the end of the year. I think that's possible, with, with your support. Anyway, everyone, stay safe, enjoy the rest of your day. I've been Zach, and goodbye.